So let's see how to uh, pick some of our sketches, uh, put them into a single document, and upload them to D2L. Uh, we'll do this in uh, Photoshop because our format for our sketches is probably a JPEG or PNG or some kind of pixel format if you scanned them or took a picture of them. So I'm going to open Photoshop. It should be in your Documents folder. It may be in your bar down at the bottom under Adobe. Yours looks different than mine. And so I've already got Photoshop open, so I'll just open it. And you don't need to do this, but... All right, so here's what we're going to do. Uh, we're going to open our sketch files in Photoshop. I'll just open one, but if you have several, that's fine. You can pick from multiple documents. Then uh, when I've got those open, I'm going to make a new Photoshop document. Uh, letter size, horizontal, 100 pixels per inch. We're going to copy and paste from our sketches into this uh, new document. We're going to add our name and number our sketches so we can refer to them. And we're going to save it as JPEG. So the first step is open uh, my sketches. So file, open. And I find my, uh, my logo sketch files. So there's one. And there it is. So I want to select a few of these and put them into a, a new document. So I'm going to make, go ahead and make that new document. So Photoshop New, Command N. And I want to go to Print, just so I can pick Letter. I'm going to make it horizontal. And just to make the file reasonable size, I'm going to switch the resolution to 100, 1000, 100 pixels per inch. RGB color white, that's all fine. So letter, horizontal, 8 by 11, 100, and I click create. There's my new file. So now I want to copy back and forth from one to the other. So up at the top, I've got all my files that happen to be open. There's my untitled file. So I'm going to go ahead and save this. And for now, I'm just going to save it as Photoshop, and we'll see why in a minute. I'm going to call it Logo uh, Selected, Good enough. and I'll save it to the desktop just so I can find it. Okay. So now I've got the uh, my target file, and then I've got my logos. So to select parts of this, I'm going to use my marquee tool, the rectangular marquee. Uh, make sure up here your style is normal. We don't want any feathering, and we should be good. So I go down here and say, okay, I would like this one. It doesn't matter if you get some uh, parts of an, another sketch or something, that's fine. And I want to copy this. So Command-C or Edit, Copy. And then I go to my target document, and I want to paste it. Command-V is in Victor, or Paste. And there it is. I can also use my Move tool up here to pick it up and put it where I want it on my page. I go back to my sketch document. Again, if you've got several sketch documents, you can have them all in different tabs up here. Go back to my marquee tool and say, okay, and I like this one. So again, I'm going to copy it, edit, copy, back to my target document, and edit, paste, there it is. I can pick it up and move it. And I'll do one more to get the idea. And so I say, okay, and I like this one. And edit. Copy. Back to my target. Edit. Paste. There it is. Pick it up and move it. Uh, when you copy and paste, it's going to put each one of these on a different layer. Just in case you get confused, uh, let's go to layers. There they are. So if I want to rearrange them, uh, I need to be on a layer. And then I can use my move tool to move the thing on that layer, etc. So a little space in Okay. Uh, then we want to add uh, our name and some numbers so when we refer to each other's work, we can see what it is. So I'll use my text tool, horizontal text tool. Up here, I'll set the font to something innocuous, plain, like Arial. And um, 24 points, that sounds fine. So I click and I just type my name. So I put a return in there for some reason. 
Uh, make sure that you have your uh, foreground color to black. If it's white or something, you won't see it. And then I want to number these. So I think we're doing four or five of them. So I click back on my text tool. Oops, I to click on some other tool to deselect this. Otherwise, it wants to continue typing there. And I'm just going to number it. So one. And again, if I click down here, I get two. Click here, three. Okay. And that way, when we talk about each other's work, we can see what they are. So even though we've got all these layers, uh, that's basically what we want. So we're going to, uh, we don't want to have this whole layered Photoshop document to put them D2L. We want a nice, simple file. So I'm going to go under File and Save As. And uh, I want to select JPEG. So in your type of document you want JPEG. That's going to flatten the document and make it simple. Again, I'll put it somewhere where I can find it. And and I'll put my name in here, or at least my initials. Hyphen. And so that's my file. MD, logo selected, JPEG. And save it. Options, uh, image options, this is the quality. Again, eight, that's fine. Really doesn't matter. Don't go too low, but for what we're doing is just a sketch. And I click OK. So now I've got a JPEG saved to my desktop. And I'm ready to go to D2L. So I go uh, into our site, Digital Foundations. I'm going to go to Communications. Go to Discussions. And we've got a Logo Sketches file here. Click on that. And I'm going to start a new thread. Enter a subject. And give it a name, Sketches. If I spell it right, that would be nice. So in here, I can just uh, click on the camera icon again. We did this last time. Insert image. And I go to my computer. And uh, you can either drag it in or go to your desktop again and find that MD logo selected JPEG. Choose it and uh, add as an attachment is fine. Choose destination is fine. Add. Uh, we do have to give it an alternative text. I guess I should say logo. It doesn't matter what it says, do really. And click OK. And now it's in there. So then we make sure that we actually post it. And it's created. That's good. So we're going to do that. And then uh, once everyone has had a chance, or at least most of us have things uploaded, then we want to look at each other's work and uh, make suggestions, comments on your classmates' work. Uh, all right, so let me stop this recording, and that's it.